Metro and Tiller, what it do, big baby? What's good? Ain't hey, shit, man. <laughs> I'm chilling, man. Beast on stage, man. Straight up. Don't, don't get him gas, man. I'm, I'm whack, man. I'm whack. I'm whack, man. It's about true right now, big baby. So what's going on? What's, what's, what's all this going on here? Basically, it's a mixtape release party for um for my mixtape, Zilla's World. I produced every track. I got Big Lou on there, Sky Zoo, um, uh, Capone from CNN, CL Smooth. A lot of people on the record, man. Right. How, how'd you work that out? Relationships. That's what this business is all about, man. It's about relationships, man. So I was able to really collaborate with a lot of good dudes, man. People that really wanted to get on the album. Man, that's for sure. Let them know how you came up. What got you started and all of that. Basically, man, I've been I've been making records for years, man. Like making beats first, but then making records in the last like five, six years. You know what I mean? Um, just bought a whole bunch of equipment at one point and just started working. You know what I'm saying? Really getting it in. Who you working with right now on some personal level tip? My artist Psycho Cyrus from Philly, working with um, uh, Deja B, she's from the Bronx, female MC, and working with uh, Priscilla Marie, female um, R&B artist from Jersey, crazy. Uh, yo, rumor has it that you're supposed to be working with this artist named Madman, right? Yeah. But I don't know what this. I've been looking for him, right, right, Yeah, right. I was trying to get an interview with him. Right. Because he won't talk on it. Right. But I want to hear your part on it. Well, it's funny because the first time that I seen Madman was at a showcase that me and Hatch threw. You know what I mean? And the one thing that I liked about him is that he had a lot, a lot of energy on stage. And I'm a strong believer in an artist is not just a recording artist. You got to be a performing artist, too. Know how to really work a crowd, know how to get the crowd into what you do. Because you got to understand the first 10 seconds of your performance is the most crucial. The one thing about Madman is that he was able to capture that crowd within that amount of time and bring him in. Lure him in. That's what it's about, man. It's about performing. You haven't seen him? I ain't seen him yet. Seen him? I'm still looking for him. I'm a, yo, I'm going to holler at him for you. Please do that. Okay. Because I'm hearing a lot. They say we look alike. Right. I don't know who this right. guy is. MySpace.com slash Drawzilla, D-R-A-W-Z-I-L-L-A. -L -L um, the mixtape will definitely be on that pit real soon. Just hit me up on the MySpace, man. Let me know what you think about the, the mixtape. The mixtape is actually on the, the page. You know what I mean? So you can actually listen to it. And uh, just let me know, like holler at me, man. I'm, I'm a, I'm a real straightforward, humble dude, man. Anybody wanna get at me, get at me. If I'm feeling your music and I'm feeling what you're doing, let's go. Let's make this record, man. That's what it's about. I'm, a, I'm very passionate about this music, man. I am not stopping. Straight up. That's what's up. Let me know a couple of joints that your music featured on on MTV. Oh man. There's a whole bunch of television shows that's actually on MTV. Like for instance, Little Bow Wow's Cribs. I got eight instrumentals placed in that show. You know what I mean? So you listen to it, the, the background music is basically my music. You know what I mean?